Hello friends, welcome you all. In this lecture, we are going to learn about the historical development of road construction. In this lecture, we are going to learn about the historical development of roads. Right? See here, definitely the humans were started to moving from one place to another place. First, they are using only footpaths. Later, they are using animals. Next, animals with cart path. Right? Definitely. See, first, footpaths. Next, they are using animals. Next, they are using animal drawn vehicles. Next, they are using uh, carts. Right? All vehicles, etc. Right? Right. So here, as a civilization involved, the need for transportation increased. Definitely, the day by day, see, with name itself tells its meaning. See, without civil, there is no civilization. Right? Definitely, so as the civilization evolved, the need for transportation increased. Next. See, the first road is as per the records romans road the romans road was constructed in the year 500 bc means before crete right they were built a straight regardless of gradient they were built after the soft soil was removed and a hard stratum was reached the thickness varies from the 0 0.75 meters to 1.2 meters. See, no problem. I will show the figure. Simple. See, first they are removing the loose soil. Right? Soft soil. Definitely, after removing the soft soil, we are getting hard stratum. Hard layer we will get. So, on that layer, they construct the road. Right? Look at this figure. This is the Roman's road of construction. Simple. See here we have a, a trench. First they will made a trench. Right. So on the uh, in the trench. They are used a, a stones. They are usually a big layer of stones. Right. Next they are using broken stones. Means small small stones they are using. A later also they are using again they are using stones. Like that. So here the construction style is like this. The Romans road construction is like this. Next. Right. Look here. This is the modern highway. Definitely here this is the lane. This is also lane. Right. In the middle we have median. Yes or no? Yes. But in the olden days the roads were like this. Right. Especially the Roman roads were like this. Right? See, they are using stones. Aggregates, right? Next, they are using bubbles. Small, small stones they are using. Again, later they are using stones. The construction style is like this. The Roman's road style. Right? Next. Other oldest road transport are we have a Trasgan construction, Metcalf construction, Telford construction, Macadam construction. See, these all types are same, maximum same, but differs maybe some, some variations are there. Next, see Indian roads. Definitely India has a large road network. We know very well. At present, 2.1 million miles kilometers are there right at present we have 2.1 million miles we have so this road network is the third largest road network in the world in the world third largest road network right next yeah in the china in the brazil we have a different different uh, uh, countries we have right next right see these all are most most important slide for me 
why because why because in all exams they will ask about the years right right so first look here in india the road development was started by the establishing the jayakar committee jayakar committee right see before independence in the year 1927 itself the jayakari committee was constituted right so the committee recommended several things so based upon the recommendations only uh, various uh, various type of institutions various types of uh, acts were developed right next central road fund see based upon the recommendation of jayakar committee only central road fund is established in the year 1929 next indian roads congress see here established in the year 1934 next crra central road research institute in the year 1950 motor vehicle act in the year 1936 next national highway authority of india that will established in the year 1995 next first 20 year road plan was started in the year 1943 to 1961 see actually this plan was for 20 years but before 2 years the plan is going to complete in the year 1961 itself the plan is completed actually they think that they want to construct the first 20 years road plan from the 1943 to 1963 but it is completed in the year 1961 itself right in the next see in the next coming classes we are learning each and everything each and every individual thing we will discuss deeply no problem right right so next second 20 year plan from the 1961 to 81 next in the year uh, 1973 hrb is constituted right hrb means highway research board next transport a policy committee is also established in the year 1978 next third year 20 uh, third 20 year road plan was established in the year 1981 to 19 sorry sorry 2001 means 20 years right that's it next jayakar committee look here see after the first world war what will happen the motor vehicle using the roads increases this demanded a better road network in india also right so based upon that situation based on the situation in the year 19 so 1927 indian road development committee was appointed by the government with mr jaykar as a chairman right so be in the jaykar committee also recommended several several things right so here an extra tax should be levied on petrol from road users right because to create the fund right next he recommended that a semi official bodies technical institutions to pool technical knowledge right to get the technical knowledge definitely we required institution right next sharing of ideas and acts as the advisory body means we required advisory bodies also right so the advisory bodies also developed later right next to create a national level institution to carry research developments works development works and consultation means see these all are the recommendations by the jaykar committee only next right see based upon the recommendation of jaykar committee the central road fund was established in the year 1929 of march 1st so to create the fund they put the tax 2.64 paisa per liter of petrol right next see here from this 20% of the annual revenue it is retained to as a certain means so fund will develop right next right see this is the central road fund this is the C, uh, again crf act will develop in the year 2000 also right constituted in the year 1929 but 
act is also passed in the year 2000 right next see here distribution of 100 percent says on petrol for example here we are getting 100 rupees from the petrol means by tax so how the tax is developed means how the uh, tax is distributed among the various uh, highways right look here see here 57 percent for national highways 30 percent for state highways 12.5 percent for safety works on rail road crossing right so this will de develop by the so these two are under the more only means ministry of road transport and highway means see national highway and state highway are under more only means ministry of road transport and highway right next so 50 percent says on diesel for rural road development that's why here we are having less price normally generally we are having less price with the diesel right but here 100 percent says here 50 percent says on the diesel right next see irc also constituted means indian road congress right in the year 1934 previously we discussed right so this is the semi-official body semi-official body means official body related to road right clear right so to provide the national forum for regular pooling of experience and ideas on matters related to the construction and maintenance of highway so this body is giving the uh, advices right for the construction and maintenance of highways right clear so if you want this matter please take this matter as a note right next right see here motor vehicle act is also passed in the year 1939 what is the function simple so to regulate the road traffic in the form of traffic laws ordinances and regulations see without laws or without ordinances without regulation so no one is maintaining traffic rules that's why motor vehicle act was passed this was revised in the year 1988 also right next crri central road research institute in the constituted in the year 1950 1950 simple see to carrying out the research and development of project means development projects right clear so for research this institution was established means to do research work while designing for construction for maintenance of roads in any way traffic right next in traffic in various cities right so all this way what are the uh, advantages means in the future how we are going to develop the uh, road and maintenance construction design so all these are under the control of CRRI. Next, Ministry of Road Transport and Highways means M O R T H. Right? More Ministry of Road Transport and Highways. Next, see planning and development maintenance of national highways in the country that's why this ministry works right next highway research board means for research only right to ascertain the nature and extent of the research required right to collect corrections uh, sorry correlation services collect result on research channelize consultative service means all this research work will under the highway research board next next 